All right, a movie adaptation of Cold Moon Over Babylon. The book from 1980. They're filming in Louisiana. In March 2015. And, and what do we know about it? I'll tell you what, it's based on the Michael McDowell book, who is a prolific writer back in the day. He wrote a number of novels. I love horror novels from the 70s and 80s. Never read one of his, but he also has a number of credits. He's written shows for Tales from the Crypt, Tales from the Dark Side, that total late 80s, early 90s era, Monsters. So that kind of makes you want to watch this. He even came up with Beetlejuice. But he died in 1999. Oh, so they're boy. finally doing an adaptation of this. It's a gothic southern horror. Good and boy. they got a good cast assembled. Josh Stewart as the lead. He was uh, Bane's henchman. What? So basically, what? You're talking about the skinny guy that turns into Bane? Or no, you're talking about his henchman. Yeah, his henchman who just grunts the whole time. The skinny goth that turns into Bane. Anyways, so it's, uh, what, this granddaughter? And Christopher Lloyd, the legendary Christopher Lloyd, supposed to be his father. So this is... Star-studded and definitely should be on people's radar. They wanted radars. me to build him a bomb. I gave him some pinball parts. <laughs> Christopher Lloyd, huh? Um. I was frozen. Today. I don't know what to say. I'm Let's talk about say. the plot. The granddaughter. Southern town. There's a there's a murder in the river, and apparently I read uh, the Goodreads reviews on the book. And ten years before, her parents were killed, or her grandparents. Depending the on river is essentially a character in itself. Oh, you're getting deep. And the eldr and the eldritch spirit comes to avenge her, and apparently the main character is almost like the villain. Metaphorically or physically? Which part? The river being a character itself. Is that metaphorically or physically? Spiritually, supernaturally. It's a and physical. <laughs> oh, who knows what the ties are? I mean, pagans Anyways, have been doing sacrifices down at the, the river. river. All right, shut up. No, no, no. no. Let, the me, dad, let me. Conf the dad owns the town. The little boy, his son or whatever, is trying to find out what's going on. And his dad owns the town. And he's trying to block the sheriff from doing his investigation. And meanwhile, the yeah, the sheriff. Ain't because gonna there's be something shit. more to tie to the ending that makes you want to sit there and watch the whole movie. When you got a phantasm to do your dirty work, your vengeance. Think about it. Obviously, you're not gonna be sure. Because who needs a sheriff? Think about it. All right, it's a chilling novel, supernatural vengeance. All the other information will be below, like the rest of the cast and the plot info, blah, blah, blah. And if we're too boring, go look up something else for yourself. And again, this is JBM and L made from Villain News. Click on the channel for more horror sci-fi comic book videos. Are right, you could hate us now.